Good morning, Don Lane, Fraser Valley News, your morning news update for this Wednesday, October the 14th. Did you watch the provincial debates last night? Uh, Shashi Curl, the moderator who is with Angus Reid, used to be a broadcaster with Global, had the best line of the night right at the end. Y'all did well. Y'all get a cookie. And she is getting applause because she reined all three of them in, Andrew Wilkinson, uh, Sonia Firstino, and John Horgan, to make sure everybody stayed reasonably to the rules. And uh, she did a phenomenal job. So as a fellow broadcaster, you did well. And of course, now the cookie jokes are flying on social media. Uh, a couple of debates locally. Uh, tonight, the Chilliwack Chamber of Commerce Online will have their debate starting at 6 o'clock on their social media. Prior to that, uh, Chill TV is uh, taping a Chilliwack Kent All Candidates meeting, which is a face-to-face -face meeting, not just answering questions uh, that are brought in from uh, online or from the audience. That will air tomorrow on Chill TV's News of the Week on the Chill TV YouTube channel. Uh, also happening, uh, Girl Guide Cookies, what's happening because of COVID? Everything's going online. We still don't know if, like the spring, other food retailers uh, will be picking up the slack. Hopefully they do, but right now, Girl Guide Cookies, you're doing it online. The other thing, uh, BC now entering a record territory, a 16th straight uh, period of state of emergency. So that's now 30 weeks. That's over a half a year now well over half a year, in a state of an emergency. Uh, advanced polls for Elections BC start tomorrow uh, for the riding of Chilliwack. That's at Cottonwood Mall for uh, Chilliwack Kent. That's at uh, Chilliwack Mall just across the street. Right now, 680,000 people have or will vote with a mail-in ballot. It'll probably hit 700,000 without any trouble at all. So we're going to keep an eye on that. Then there was the wind yesterday. FVN's uh, intrepid uh, freelance reporter, Sean Glazier, was out and about with his video camera, including uh, some incredible footage of that certain trampoline that kind of bounced around uh, uh, Chilliwack. Uh, and also uh, plenty of damage. BC Hydro, last we checked as of 7 o'clock this morning, had about roughly 3,000 customers still in the dark. A lot of them in Cultus Lake, about 500 customers. Uh, slowly, things are getting back together, back back in uh, in play. Ryder Lake took uh, a brunt of the uh, the heat, uh, the wind rather, as well. If there's something we should know about. Let us know. Fvn at shaw.ca. Fvn at shaw.ca. It's actually supposed to be a fairly nice day today, as opposed to yesterday. Don Lane Fraser Valley News.